we began to move towards our next destination, the crafts village of Raghurajpur. On the way, we crossed Pipli, known for its applique work. Yes, I also think it's beautiful, but we had very little time to stop. As we entered Raghurajpur, true to its reputation, we found an artist at every doorstep. So we heard of this village where generations have spent their whole lives just making handicrafts. It is said that there are at least nine types of handicrafts made over here and that every single child born over here is a future artist. We met a man carving palm leaves. Later, the surface would be rubbed with coal and wiped off. That will highlight the intricate carving on the leaf panels. But this is not all. Among the most popular of Raghuraj products are the Patachitra paintings. The Patachitra tradition can be traced back to the 8th century AD, making it one of the earliest forms of indigenous paintings. Gods and goddesses, Krishna Leela, mythology, these are the main subjects of the art. This art is passed on from one generation to the other within a family. In this house, every single member is hard at work. Each child of the house is at a different stage of learning. The young practice on slate and chalk under the watchful eyes of their father. The older ones copy images on paper. And she will eventually be an expert like her sisters who are busy coloring this spread. It takes days to paint a single creation. Patachitra are world-renowned and have made Raghurajpur a heritage village. The Raghurajpur artists also make masks and practice wood carving. These toy-like figures are actually idols of Lord Jagannath and his companion Subhadra and brother Balram. And these masks made from paper mache are also inspired by mythology. A walk in the lanes of Raghurajpur is overwhelming. State protection and patronage have kept the art still going strong. It is impossible to find such a talent pool and beauty in the whole wide world. Talent is born and nurtured in every single house here. So if you are also an art lover and appreciate the handicrafts of India, you must vote for Raghurajpura.